Okay. What? That's right. Public. All right. Mute it out. Okay, this thing is public now. Okay, finally, Marvin, Marvin better said, finally, we good. Now we good. And look who we got over here. In the street. We're at Sasson headquarters right now. <laughs> One of the only Michael Sasson is in the house. And we was talking like we talk. And then that's when we realized that we need to make a, you know, touch on a, on a topic here. You know, because the moment me and Michael, we start beefing and shit like that is contradicting. Then he goes again. Man. You're bad. You're super bad. You're super bad. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know why. But we're, we're fine now. We're fine. We're fine. We're good. So the moment we was talking, right? You know, and the moment that the conversation gets heated up, and then it's heated up, very heated up. And that's when that's when uh, me and Michael, we, sp we speak and say, yo, we need to take this one. And we need to put this one out because I believe that our community, the community of freestyle, since they, they ain't got no, they ain't got nowhere to vent about this one, you know, and I know this because I tried calling CNN and NBC and NBC, you know what I'm saying? That's fake and news. Ain't nobody want to get my conversation, man. Today, I wanted to speak to like Walter, Walter Conkright. <laughs> motherfucker be lying to me. <laughs> Say Walter been there for like 10 years. <laughs> Walter Mercado? Walter Conkright. Walter Bunk. Do you know what I'm... The bunch of lies. <laughs> Sir, my, uh, Walter Conkright has been dead for a while now. I'm like, no, nah, man. My boy. He's been calling you. He was dead. That, no wonder. <laughs> no wonder I couldn't get through. He was dead. <laughs> so, Did you get his voicemail? Nah, man. Oh, we're good. We're good. So we're good. And basically, this one, you know, this is one of those those uh, topics, controversial topics that new messages. I'm, I'm trying to learn this thing below. Okay. Guys, if you want to come through, you know you're welcome to come through. All you need to say is send me a, an invite because I want to come through. I want to I wanna speak my mind. I guess Yo, call, call, call Billy Wright. Yeah. No, but I want to I wanna be able to say what, what, what we said. That we want, we want people to have a platform so they can vent. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so but the, th the thing is, the problem is, everybody's so sentimental in their feelings and shit when shit goes down, you know? And, and that's the problem here. Like, these people here, we say something that is not supposed to hurt your feelings, and there they go. They take right. it a thousand degrees. <laughs> The other way, like PMP Gonzalez says, what's the topic? The topic is very, it's very simple because I believe that this, this coming up election, we have a, a very simple election. Either yeah. you, you are a Democrat or you're a Republican. Nothing in the middle. I'm in the middle because I don't like Dick Stain, Donald Trump. You are Bernie Sanders supporter. Bernie's out of the, the, the race already. I'll take Bernie Sanders over Dick, Day, Dick Stain, Donald Trump all day. Don't be saying that around here, son. A lot of Trump support around here. But it's true. Like, my, my homeboy, Michael Rappaport, says that is dick stain Donald Trump. Well, that's your opinion, bro. Like, and people... Oh, hold on one second. The hotline is open, too. Hold on one second. Because I, I forgot I had the hotline. If you want to remain anonymous, you could. If you want to say a few words about this uh, important matter for all of us, you can come through and talk to us right here, right now. The hotline is open. So who, who, 
You think you Democrats? Maggie Lab says she's a Democrat. <laughs> this one is oh. I think this one is split right in the right in the smack center. A lot of people around here are Trump supporters. So 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 let, let me ask you this question, Bernardo. Would you rather have Dick stain Donald Trump? Right? Or would you rather have a 90-year-old man in the White House that's almost ready to croak as a president? Mm. <laughs> the guy's almost 90 years old. Who's 90 years old? Biden? <laughs> he's like 80 years old, I think. Biden? Yeah. <laughs> he looks like he's sleeping all the time when he's talking. <laughs> affection is affection is Biden because Biden is very touchy, touchy guy. He grabs people and what's up, baby? And, you know, hi, honey, and shit like that. Yeah, he grabs him right, right up the ass. No, he's affectionate. He like he likes to, so you know. Okay, Rudy Velasco says he's a Republican. Maggie Lab says she's neither. Uh, um, Ada Torres, she says she's an independent. She's gonna be voting for uh, Kanye, I guess. I'm gonna vote for Kanye West. That's who I'm gonna vote for. I don't think Kanye is no longer in the race. <laughs> I don't. Well, even, gonna, well, I don't think. Gonna... Mm -hmm. I'm gonna vote for Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, Arnold's not. It's not gonna be. People, uh, this is a very uh, heated topic. So if you want to come through the crisis, uh, not the crisis. Said, hold on. Who said they were Republican? Uh, Republican. No, somebody said that they were Rudy. Republican. Rudy. 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 Velasco says he's a Republican. Rick Sepulveda said only four years older than Dick Stain. <laughs> Who? <laughs> I got these people calling him Dick Stain, Donald Trump. <laughs> Don't disrespect the president of the United States of America. <laughs> Dick Stain, Donald Trump. Yeah. Yeah, Donald Trump. Uh, what I want to see is, you know, I, I want to see the job done. You know what I'm saying? I want to see a, a good job done in the next four years. So, what? Well, so, so you want to see if I can? Uh, let's let me try calling. Get, uh, uh, get get Billy right on here because I got a bone to pick with him because I think he likes Dick Stain, Donald Trump. Give me a second here. Let me see if I can get. Uh, let me see if I can get Billy right in here. People, if you guys want to come through, you can call the hotline. Hotline is open. Let's see if I can get um okay, give me a second right here. Let's see if he answers. He doesn't deserve respect. No, no, respect for the president. Who said that? No, because I said respect for the president, and, and he uh Rick Sepulveda says uh he doesn't deserve respect. He don't, yeah. Is he? Let me see. Nah, he's not answering at this particular moment. Yeah, we'll get him on there. We'll get him on. But um, yo, you know what? Call call Ron Henry. I want to see where he lies on this. Uh, Rudy Velasco says if Kanye would have run for president, the whole nation would have been bipolar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yo, the, yo, if Kanye was the win, they'd be like, Jesus walks. All right, let me see if I can get um. Call wrong Henry. Let me, let, let's call. Let's call the wrong Henry. I like messing with the wrong Henry. Hold it. <sighs> All right, let's call the, the wrong hand. Hold on. Don't oh, he probably knows I'm on. Who else is on here? I want to know everybody else's opinion. I can't see who's That's messaging. That's what I'm so. talking about. That's funny. Who? No, there's people. You, you can't see the comments? 
No, because I'm on my phone with it. That's why. Oh, I'll, I'll read them to you. Henry. Henry. Okay. Let me see if he wants to answer. Give us a second, people. Give us a second. Trying to get all these people online. Henry. The one and only. My brother Henry. What's up, bro? Henry. I got this pe I got these people. They're they are they are online. Michael's online. Mike Wrong Henry. No, that's not Ricky. That's Michael Sasson. He wanted to know. He, oh, oh, you. He wanted to know your 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 opinion about about the. Wrong, Henry. We. No, 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 no. Yeah, we're live. We're live. <laughs> no, no. We we live. We live. We live. Oh, uh, yeah. Henry's spinning. Oh, he's spinning? Tell him, tell him he could win a lot and spin the bottle. K Kathy. Yo, uh, uh, Red is right here. What's up, B? What's up, girl? Rudy Velasco says, Goya, Sazon. Goya, fuck out uh, Okay, hold on. Yeah, let me let me let me let me bring you in. Hold on, so he can hear you. Hold on, hold on. All right, Henry, you in here, bro? Hey, what's up? What's up, Henry? What you what you want, fool? What's up? What's up, what's up my fool? What's up, fool? Oh, you got, what's up? What's going on, Henry? What's Henry. up, man? How you feeling, bro? You feeling like a Democrat for the next uh, election or like a Republican, bro? Oh, today I made a decision, man. I'm done with politics on Facebook. I, I was just going fucking bananas uh, with uh, comment, you know, my comments, my opinions, and fighting with people. And you know what? I, today I said, "Fuck that! I'm done with that, man." Uh, uh, what? I'm gonna Why? Go to because uh, I'm spending too much time on, you know, debating with people and arguing and this and that. And I, you know, really, I don't, you know, I just not, it's not me. It, it be, it's not really me. But I, I turned into like this monster on Facebook, of, you know, uh, talking about I created politics, a monster. I'm sorry. Know, fighting with people and getting nasty with people. People getting nasty back with me. I would put posts up and then people would like not even know each other and then fight on my posts. I was creepy. <laughs> <laughs> My post was making people fight, bro. She was crazy. Oh my god! I, 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 you know, I, and I said, "Man, that's not me, Henry." Not me. But Henry, let me ask you a simple question: Are you voting Democrat or are you voting Republican in you our know, next I'm not election? Voting at all? Fuck all. Hey, of hey, you know what? I think they're all, I, in my opinion, see, I, I don't really want to get into this because I don't. This might, this shit like that, questions like that, and answers causes a response. And, and it hit rest people the wrong way because then all of a sudden the real arrogant people that really know think they think they know everything start fighting start throwing shots back at you you know I got mm -hmm. my personal reasons why I don't I, I think all politicians are full of shit you know really so mm -hmm. uh, and the choice the choice that we got it's not really a good choice it's like when you go to a fish market to buy Fish and all the fish smell bad. <laughs> Which one do you buy? Right? <laughs> you know, that's how I feel. But, but if, yeah, that's true. Henry, but if you don't vote, I know, I know. There's always if you don't vote, there'll never be change. I know. Yeah, and but we've been we've been waiting for change for how many years? Fish market and you go to buy fish and they all smell. What do you do? You go buy. You go to another market and buy beef. You know, <laughs> you buy. <beef. laughs> you know, you go to another market and you become a vegetarian, or you don't eat one or the other. Uh, 
just the way it is. And maybe in another four years, if I see a better person uh, running that I that I support, then I love them. <laughs> Henry, hold on one second. I get a, a comment here for from a lady named Mary Gates, and she says, hey, "She says, what's up, Mary? Hey, WTF kind of on, uh, analogy was that Henry smelling fish." <laughs> <laughs> I was using that as an example. As an example, Mary Gates, the, you know, it was just that if you go to as as you know, I don't need to repeat myself. I was like. Comparing that, like when you go, if you go to buy fish, and they, all, the, all the fish things, you don't buy it. Well, that you know, the presidents, the choices for the president choice, they all stay. Henry and Michael, this is what Rudy Velasco just said. So embarrassing. We need a smarter president. It's sad. The, I see. The, like, the, the other have... country, the other countries are laughing at our presidency. It's true, though. It's true. I, I guarantee everybody's laughing at us. You know. Yeah. I don't... Uh, uh, you know, I was talking to a good friend of mine, and he said something about Trump that was interesting because a lot of he's from New York, right? And New York are very loud, bold people, and, and they they don't give a fuck and they speak their mind. So he so put, so he goes into office, and then he's got that New York toughness attitude. You know, um, he's not from no laid back backwoods country. You know, politician. You know. He's a straight in your face politician, and you know he 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 he, he intimidated China. Look what he did. <laughs> Rick he Rick Rick China. Sepulveda says so. You go to a different fish place, WTF. Right, exactly. You go to a different fish market, right? And get and you get something fresh. Well, in this case, when you got two presidents, one that's ancient dinosaur that's been in a Democrat, which I, I I'm a liberal. I am a liberal. I will say that, but. You know, you have a, a liberal, and you have uh, McCain. He's been there and back. You know, um, so it's like it's okay. like you're gonna give him a second chance. He was vice president, so they're gonna give him. You know, wait and see what happens. Let's say, let's say Biden does win, right? Let's say he does win. Let's see what he does in four years. Yo, know, if he you wins, know, he's not. We're, let's we're, see we're if he. It, it'll be a fucking miracle if he wins and he fixes everything that Donald Trump fucked up. That'll be a you know, and then uh, he got a AOC. Me, uh, there's a Henry. He's you know he's got a young politicians holding him up. <clears throat> Henry, <laughs> uh, Sam, Sam said no, no one's laughing at America. Trump 2020 signed a Canadian. So you on, got, wait a so your, your comment. So your comments got Trump supporters and they got Democrats. Got, they got Republicans and Democrats talking uh, the fight uh, uh, debating. Yep. Both yeah, but, but, but Henry, Henry, so, Henry. They're talking. They're talking about Dick Stain Donald Trump. Hold on, I got. Hold on. Uh, let me read Kathy's uh, comment. She, she says, "No problem with not voting. The problem with not voting at all isn't good because it puts your future in other people's hands." To that, David, that's true. So, 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 you know, usually, first of all, I put, I shot myself in the foot by 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 exposing that because usually. Voting, when you talk, ask somebody they're going to vote, that's privileged information. Okay. You're really supposed to keep that shit to yourself. Mary, Mary, to, to, avoid, to, to avoid being shot, you know, to, told that. Okay. You Ma know? Mary Gates. Um, Mary and, uh, so um, I fucked up. I should have just said, yeah, I'm going to vote and kept it like that, you know? Henry, Henry, I'm, Mary. I'm a dumbass. I'm Ma a dumbass. I said I'm not going to vote. I'm too fucking honest. Okay. But anyway, you're, but she's she's absolutely right. Okay, hold on, yeah. Henry. Mary Gay says, "Give the man who doesn't know the difference between his wife and sister a chance." Great. <laughs> As Sam says, Biden can't even remember his own name. Yeah, he's a yeah. Rick's like a booper. I said. Rick's yes, a, well, you know they have. There's a thing called convenient amnesia, but it's just like <laughs> most politicians do. How many times that Trump says he don't remember shit, right? Hey, Mary Gay, you know, he, Mary he Gay, the other day. No, I want to have he, Mary he Gay. Some, I want to. Trump fucks up tweets all the time. Mary Gay, can and, you can uh, you call the there hotline? There was a guy. There was a KKK. There was a guy who said white power the other day driving by on the fucking golf cart and white power, white power, and, and, and Trump says, "Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't hear that." And, you know, he, yeah. so they're both old fuck. They're both old fucks, and they and they shoot each shots at each other. And you know, the, the, I think the most, you know, like like they said, if we get people like me 
that will vote, or maybe we can vote them out. I, I have beliefs about the voting system, too. I think that shit is corrupt, and that's real. The, the right. voting system is very corrupt. I think that that shit is fixed. Okay, that, that, that's that's my, beliefs. my ability, my beliefs, in my opinion, the electoral votes are the ones that make the decisions on who wins. Correct. I really don't really understand how that works. I know a little bit, but our votes are, they're just there. But the electoral votes is what makes who, who decides what the president is. People call who it Hollywood. Yeah, call I said, I, and I, anybody I, who understands how that shit works, enjoy figuring that shit out. And, and um, I, I believe it. everybody know who the president's going to be. Yeah. Especially, I, I, especially in Florida. Florida. I'm a, I'm Florida a conspiracy guy. I'm trying to recover from that. I, I'm trying to stay away from it. And, 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 and when you try to get out something, you got to Bernardo called you and sucks you right back into it. <laughs> Henry. The, Did you see my post earlier? Yeah. I actually made a post two hours ago saying that I exercised the political demons from me so I could focus on playing music on Mary, Facebook. Mary, and, Mary and, Gates, call, call the hotline. I, I, can I, can I can't see you. I can't see you. I can't see you. I can't see I had so much fun with her. We had fun at that chai party. I know, oh I know. my God! It was an amazing. Call the hotline, uh, Mary, so we could, you know, it's uh, the hotline. No, it's out here. Henry, I didn't, I didn't see your post because I, I don't, I don't have you as my friend on there no more because you, you got me mad and you reported me, so I don't have you on there no more. Yeah, well, you know, those were the old days where you know <laughs> it happened, and, and that's water under the bridge. You know, uh, yeah. cause this is the. You know, we I we really didn't know each other. That was all big fun games. It was fun and games that turned into feelings getting hurt and people getting upset. So uh, if anything, I'm I'm mad enough to apologize to anything that I done or said to you. Oh, I always, I really I what made me do that is somebody did a Photoshop. I don't know if it was you or the other partner did a Photoshop of me and uh, um, the other guy uh, hanging out fishing, and that got me really upset. So that's why I did that. Because, uh, do you remember that? The Photoshop of me and the other guy? Yeah, I had received that. That wasn't even me or Billy Wright. Somebody sent that to me. And yeah, but you guys, one of you guys posted it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Somebody you, sent it, it was, to me. One of you guys posted it. Yeah, somebody so tagged me on I, it. I did that. And it went back and forth. Yeah, I, you know, again, yeah. that's the water, it's Like you said, water under the bridge, you know? Cool. I'm cool with that, Papa. Yeah, water under the bridge. All right, so, so you know, I don't mind. I don't mind linking up with you on Facebook again, bro. Uh, you know, but but wrong, Henry. Fighting with young Sam, me. you're much younger than me. People, I'm too old. To, I'm I'm too old to be. That, you know, be that, people, bro. Exactly, it's like Bernardo said. I'm 19 years old. Yeah, Sam. <laughs> Sam says, if you hate Trump, you hate America. Sign a Canadian. Oh, yo, matter of fact, put Sam on the phone because I want to know how do you hate America if you hate Trump? That's an opinion. Okay, so if you yeah, hate Michael, Trump, hey, Michael, you're absolutely right. Opinions are not facts. So, my, my good friend of mine, he's very intelligent. He told me, he says, Henry, you're not, you're arguing opinions. You know, we're arguing our, our opinions are arguing, really, not facts. And then people try get facts and then they twist it into their opinion. Let me <clears> let me read Maggie. You know, Maggie Maggie and, says something. And, Hold and on a second. A big difference. Maggie says, so, "Can we have Bill Clinton as president?" Who cares what I, the fuck? Listen, I'll take. Listen, I'll take Bill Clinton all day. Bill Clinton, I'll take all day because we never had any issues with anything. The only thing he fucked up was was getting his shit sucked, and I'll take that president all day because that means there's a bunch of sex going on in the White House. I'll take that all day. <laughs> Sam says. Yeah, it's, well, Sam says well, it seems like all the Biden well, supporter have a lot in common with Biden. What like coming? I said, what Sam, you got something to say? You well, say it on I, the hotline. Call in. You know, I I believe all those past administrations that were before all this were all business as usual. They were just passing the torch to each other on on uh, and, and then doing things their way. And then it took a, a crazy fucking nut like Trump to go in there and throw a monkey wrench in the uh, in the grinding wheels of our government, and, and to try to ch change things around. So uh, so the question is, do we want change and do we want a, 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 a psychopath that's to, 
to continue to, to run this country? Or do we want things to go back the old way where shit was fucked up that way too? <laughs> right? It, it doesn't make sense. So do we take gambles and risk and let a, 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 a egotistical um, businessman type maniac continue to run the country? You know what? There's one thing, and I hate saying this, and I'm going to probably piss a lot of people off. Oh, my God. But when it came to him wanting to have business and all the products, like the sneakers we wear and the pants we wear, everything made in America rather than in China, I like that. I, I like that idea, but the way he did it, he fucking pissed off China and and put tariffs on them, and they had to close down like four of their ports that deliver to us, and then coincidentally, after he did that, we wound up with a virus, virus from them. <laughs> but I look what happened. The virus not only fucked us up, it fucked them up too. Hold on, Mary Gay, so, don't leave. What you need to do is come through. Let me put you, I'll call the hotline so I can put you through. You can speak your mind right here, man. Okay, Sam says, trust me, you need Trump to protect y'all from getting bum rushed by Korea or China. Well, he's a tough president, so if anything, people, he's not no damn bitch ass who, Jimmy Carter, you know? <laughs> well, Jimmy Carter, everybody loves Jimmy Carter and his peanuts. Uh, you guys were young. You guys were too young. You guys were kids when Jimmy Carter was president. I was a teenager. You know, the reason why I'm in this country is because of Jimmy Carter, right? You are, right? Yeah. You see, he was a nice guy. Jimmy Carter was a very nice president. He's loved. He was a, he's a loved president. Jimmy Carter, he don't even need security. That's how loved he was. He could he could wake up in a fucking, at 12, he could go to a store at 12 o'clock in the afternoon Mary, and go buy, and buy some donuts okay, and come Mary, home and, and Mary, nobody would try to hurt him. Mary Gates says, yeah. Mary Gates says, China bent over the USA for too long. China bent over the USA for too long. That's what Mary Who Gates said. That? Mary Gates. Well, then she must know something. I don't know. People don't know because it's. it's okay. I know if you look at everything here, everything that you know, um, a lot of stuff is made comes out of there. It's made from child child okay. labor. And Ada, slaves. Ada Ada Torres says Trump is not protesting our our soldiers pro protecting our soldiers from Russia. WTH makes you think he is going to protect us from any country. What the what the hell? Yeah. Well, these are again. These are uh, I'm one of them. Uh, everything I say applies back to me. These we these are we are all Facebook politicians. We became journalists. We became lawyers. We are politicians. We got degrees in fact finding. So all this stuff that you're hearing from everybody, including myself, is basically our opinion, unless you got a, a fucking library in your house with all documents uh, backing up everything that you're saying. I like what you're saying, because basically it's, at least we have a voice over here, because, you know, where else could you, like, you know, we all want to talk about this one, and here it is. I, you yeah, know, I want now we have a platform right here where we're going to talk about this one from here to election day. But Bernardo, hold on. Well, I want to get that. I want to get that dude Sam on the phone because he got a lot to say about Donald Trump, and I want to see why he supports him so much. Henry, you think I could call you in, uh, send you an invitation? You know how to come through uh, and be live. That way, I can use the line for somebody else. Yeah, I got. Be, I have be live. Okay, let me send you an invite. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. All right. Right. I gotta go on. I gotta go on. I gotta go on your Facebook page. Then, yeah, I'll right? send it to you. Just click on it, okay? Uh, all right. So, okay. All right. All right. So, Henry, Henry, uh, bounce. Let me let me bring him in. So you guys can have a uh, uh, that line. Okay. Let me copy this one so I can bring. Um, say it, Michael, while I do this. Yo, I just want to know. I just want to know why Sam's on Dick Stain Donald Trump's dick so hard. I'm gonna call Sam and, uh, now. Let me get. Um, and he keeps talking me... about. Cam I mean, the thing is, he's got to understand. A lot of people don't like what Donald Trump does. I'm not saying Donald Trump does everything bad. He's not perfect neither. But the shit he does is sometimes stupid. The shit that he says sometimes is stupid. 
why are we going to have a president that doesn't know how to speak at a press conference to run the United States? He already ran it into the damn ground. What more do you want him to do? Okay, let me call Sam. Sam, I'm going to call you through the audio, okay? See if he wants to talk a moment over here. While I wait for Henry. We're waiting for Henry to come through. He ate boss hog. Okay. Henry's coming through. Hold on a second. Let you got, a president. You got a president that threw toilet uh, paper towels at fucking Puerto Ricans. Like, that makes no fucking sense. Okay. Hold on one second. Sam. Let's see how it gets Sam over here. We're waiting for the wrong Henry to come through. There he is. There he is. Okay. Hey! Fucking Michael Sasson. What's up, bro? <laughs> Shit. Chilling. Yo. <laughs> How's everything, bro? How, how, hey, you got, how you doing with the COVID no. thing? You get everybody okay? Yeah, everybody good. Everybody safe. Good. Say Fucking it, Bernardo, man. Bernardo is uh, he, and people love him. Pop. People love this guy, right? Right, Michael? We, you love to hate him. They love to hate him. Yeah. yeah but, you know, at, at least we're doing something, man. You know, getting... Well, sweet. I like this platform better because people get to be their real selves. I was an idiot when you guys met me. I was acting a fool for attention and having a... You know, thinking it was a good time and attention. It was just... But, you know, I got to learn a lot about myself and people and shit like that. So I don't want to get... What's the word? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm I'm, gonna, I don't want to start preaching, man. I'm, I'm, audio I'm audio calling Sam. Okay. Sam, what's up, bro? Sam, we uh, uh, audio call, bro. It's not video call. Yo, Sam, son. Audio call. Audio call. There we go, son. Let us speak a little while. Yeah, fucking. Oh, Sam. I, got, I think I got one more cigarette left. I smoke. I, you know, I stopped doing everything else, so now I smoke. <laughs> yeah. Let me call. Let me call Mary Gates. Audio call Mary Gates. Mary Gates. Mary. Yo, she is so fun to hang out with. You gotta. You gotta meet her one day. She is like so cool. She is so cool. Mary Gates. Yeah. Let's ask Mary Gates a few questions about our 2020. You know, like, yeah, I don't know. Mary Gates has a pro political views. I really don't know what they are, but I'll tell you one thing. I okay. wouldn't want to get, I wouldn't let's get, get into it. Now. Let's, see if, let's see if Mary Gates want to uh, give us her opinion about this one. I wouldn't want to get into it. With her. She, she ain't going to come on. Right. I'm on, I'm she, on. Might, she, she might. On. Hold on, Mary, Mary Gates, the one and only Mary Gates, the legendary oh, Mary Gates is here. What's oh, up, Sarge? What's up, Sarge? Hey, Henry. Hey, hey. What's How going on? Uh, Mary Gates, what do you think of uh, of this upcoming election, man? You know, we want to know your opinion on this. Okay, well, let me tell you something. I think between both candidates, they both have flaws. Um, Biden has lost his goddamn mind. He has. He's just a <laughs> puppet. He's only a puppet. The man doesn't even know that he's running for president. He thinks he's running for Senate. <laughs> Obviously, he's not. There's no difference between his wife and his sister. There's another problem, and you want this man to run the fucking country? Yeah, I remember that. I remember something like that. Yeah, he, he gets his words twisted and shit like that. Yeah, He's absolutely, he has dementia, and it's obvious. And now when he speaks, he's got a little thing in his ear so that people can tell him what to say. So he is just the puppet to the masses behind him. And now, let me let me tell you what I think about Trump because everybody knows I am a huge Trump supporter. I am. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't know that, Mary. I really didn't know that. I'm also going to say this. He Does he get out of line sometimes? Absolutely. Does he run his mouth more than he should? Absolutely. Does he say stupid shit all the time? He's a New Yorker. <laughs> but he's still getting the job done. Our economy is fantastic. People have jobs. Unemployment rates are the lowest that they've ever been. 
I mean, the only thing you can argue about him is that he doesn't think before he speaks. But behind the desk, he does what he needs to do. And if y'all look at your 401ks, if you got them, then you can't argue that fact. Mary Gate, can you watch the comments? Um, let me see. Henry, don't don't yeah. think close to the mic because it's it'll peak. Okay. I like what Mary Gates is saying. She's... Hey, well, I'm not, I'm not. That's one girl that I do not want to go into it with. <laughs> with but you I'm, said... I, I'm, 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 I'm digressing. Rick, let me I, tell you I, something. I he, didn't okay, cage, he didn't cage my child. However, if you remember correctly you will know that the person who started that was your boy Obama. Obama started caging people, not Trump. So before you start throwing stones in glass houses, you should make sure that you know your facts. Yeah, well, I, Rick, that was Rick. He was the one that said that. I'm not, yeah. I'm, I'm being cool with my opinion about Trump. Is my, Mary, my opinion about Trump is my opinion. And today I made a decision. Listen, really. Everybody has an opinion, like everybody's got an asshole. I don't really give two shits to know it. It's not. Yeah, my, that's why I'm not going to say it. That's why I'm not going to say uh, it. But you I'm should not, say listen, it. No, because no, I'm not. I'm, I'm not, not going to bash my president. I voted for Obama two times. You I did? Think. I'm yeah. a registered Democrat. Yeah, you did. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to bash the man who's leading my country. That's like getting on a fucking airplane and saying, I hope this pilot crashes. You want to be on a crashing fucking plane? Because I sure as hell don't. Yeah, you know, Mary, I'll, I'll say one thing, Mary. When, at the end when, of the day, no matter who the president is, as a citizen of this country, you should support them. Doesn't mean you have to like them, but you should stand behind them because he's the leader of our country. And maybe that's and why not, I made the choice to really like said, keep my opinion. Pilot Mary, that that's why I kept my, I'm keeping my opinion to myself because he's the president. And you're, you're, you're kind of, you're right there. Because I didn't like when, remember when he was in Korea? Was it Korea? They were having, they were televising his impeachment while he's over there with the enemy trying to, you know, fix shit. And they're televising his, his fucking impeachment for the whole world to see. I didn't like that. That wasn't right. Even you though, know what? Listen, they, you, know, you don't do like that, that shit when your president is oh, someone hey, else, even if you don't like him or whatever. You don't right. do that shit. I didn't like that. That, you know, really. Sorry. Okay, but here's how I look at it. Here's you know? how I look at it. Everybody else views things differently. Here's how I look at it. They did everything in their power to impeach this man because, you know why? Because he's transparent. What other yeah, person that. know that. Yeah. that tells it like it is and doesn't sugarcoat? And he tells you, listen, no, this is what they're doing. This is what they're trying to do. Look at everything from Kavanaugh to the to the dossier, to the impeachment, to everything. And the last thing before the coronavirus came out, Nancy Pelosi said verbatim that we will do whatever it takes and at whatever cost to the citizens of the United States to make sure that this man does not become president again. So then they have this huge meeting in China, and then all of a sudden we have coronavirus. Maybe it's a conspiracy theory. I don't know. There's but a lot of that, yeah. Much, a lot of conspiracies. Much, yeah. That'll always that, be there. Someone here says that Mary, Mary for, for VP. I'm going for president. Give me uh, 2028. I'm running. 2028. Sarge, Mary Gate will be running. Mary, you have, Mary, you have a MAGA hat? You have a MAGA hat? I have a MAGA everything. <laughs> MAGA tattoo or MAGA everything. <laughs> Oh shit! There she goes. It doesn't matter. Listen, Trump has my vote. Trump has my vote. At the end of the day, if they had a different candidate for the for the Democrats, I would be okay. Maybe I would think about it. But I mean, do you go with the devil that you know or the devil that you don't? Rick, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Deplorable people on here. Deplorable. What does that uh, mean? Oh, we're gonna go now. We're gonna result to name calling because we don't have anything intelligent to say. Boy, yeah, the the the, the, the opinions and the opinions are gonna go crazy. Okay, uh, so all the Facebook lawyers Ada, and Ada, Ada, Ada Torres Rodriguez. She says economy is crashed. People are dying. 401k is down. Racism is on high, and hate is on one hundred. 
okay, really? The economy cr is crashed. Have you, do you not watch the stock market? Maybe if you had some investments, you'd know that the economy is not crashed. Number one, number two, all this hate is because of this black lives matter garbage nonsense. This that's racism right there. That's racism. This all started with one bad cop, actually three bad cops. That's how that started. People are dying because there's a fucking virus out there. People die from the flu too. Why aren't we talking about that shit? Don't start nitpicking at every little thing that you see in here and then blame it on Trump. Trump didn't make the fucking coronavirus. He didn't pull it out of his fucking pocket and start sprinkling it on people. You really going to blame a virus on the president? But it, what happened with SARS or, or the bird flu or the swine, whatever, with Obama? Nobody talks shit then. Come on, stop. This is because you hate the man. You hate the man because he's doing his fucking job. You hate the man because he doesn't want to give you free shit because he wants you to get up off your ass and get a fucking job. That's why you hate him. Like, he threw paper, paper towels at Puerto Ricans. Okay, he was okay. Let's talk about that. He was throwing. He was. What if he threw paper towels or toilet paper or Lysol? Then there's a problem that he was throwing it out. Like you know, here's your supplies. You know the supplies that weren't given out by the Puerto Rican government because they're so fucking corrupt. You mean that time? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Because I'd really like to get into that one too. Let's 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 nitpick on him throwing toilet paper as opposed to the fact that millions and millions and millions of dollars were stolen by the government of Puerto Rico, and you're worried about a fucking roll of toilet paper? Come on, get your priorities straight. I am actually. What about all those supplies that sat in the, in those bunkers for? For months and months and months and months, while people were crying, saying that the United that President Trump isn't helping, yet they were there the whole time. Let's talk about that, Michael. Want to talk about that, or we still want to talk about fucking toilet paper? I want to talk about toilet paper. Yeah, I like. The well, that's paper. because you don't. Your priorities are where they're at. So, I mean, when you have your head well, up your ass that far, you can't see the light. So, I, I kind of get first, it. First of hey, all, <clears throat> Mary, I didn't come at you in no type of way. I just asked a know, question. But if you want to get technical there, we can get technical there all you want. Well, I'm trying to be nice, let's I'm get trying technical. to be nice about it. You just threw out, oh, let's all talk said, about him throwing was, toilet paper. What the fuck I said was toilet paper. What does that have to do with, it? Have to do with anything political? That's all I fucking said. Order in the platform. But I know, but Order why bring it up? Why bring it up? I, what's I, significant? Why can I bring it up? And what is the importance of the toilet why paper? Why can't I bring up Dick Stain Donald Trump while he does wrong? And I'm gonna call him Dick Stain Donald Trump because he's a perverted Wait, motherfucker. He's throwing toilet paper out right now. People are fucking over that shit, right? Because of the coronavirus. God. Okay, hold on. But, Let me hold on. Go. Kathy, Kathy says, hold on. She says, does she have to come in here? She says that virus was secretly let into the country on purpose. Obama tried to Absolutely. warn the people ahead of time while he was president. Absolutely, she's right. You know why? Because just like Henry said. The China got pissed off that we tariffed them. How many? How much longer could we have gotten bent over? They're, you know how much money they're making and how much money we're losing? Yeah, tariff them. Absolutely. You want a stronger economy? Then you tariff people. You want a stronger economy? Let them start supporting all these other countries. Why do we have to support everybody? Yeah, well, there's, a, there's a lot of information that's, that's under investigation about the virus now on how it was from being transported it was it was it was already born already and they uh, and uh, uh, a china scientist was here and he was taking it to there you know there's a lot of information people are being investigated yep. now way before it came out that it was already already no, uh, known about and already been uh, uh, exposed and all kinds of going on about it and they're still <laughs> investigating it oh, the people oh, who oh, were oh, behind oh. it the Bill Gates was involved with that there's a big investigation going on so, and, they're, and they're still trying to put the pieces to that puzzle on how it was how it came about but okay, what sorry. I want to say is one thing yeah. everything Mary you oh, just said God. was pretty up, was, was you good. never shut up take a breath oh huh? Breathe. Who? Me? Auto in the platform, please. <clears throat> All right, Auto. here's the thing. 
as a leader, right? As a leader, she uh, said a lot of things yeah. about Somebody Trump and why she believes now. he's this and that. But as a leader, he should do a better job as de uh, defusing all the division that that's being caused, whether his tweets or whether he got haters, the haters that hate him and he hates people. He's not doing anything to try to de defuse things. Instead, he's uh, he's adding more fuel to the fires that are going on instead of trying to say, hey, wait a minute, Sh shit is crazy in this fucking country. Let me try to say something and do something to stop all this shit. Instead, he's throw he, he continues because of his agenda, because he knows that people hate him. And it seems like the more people hate him, the more he feels the hate. If you know people hate you and don't like you and despise you, why continue to fuel it? Okay, Regardless okay. Whether he's uh, whether I'm right or wrong, I know I got to do something as a president, as a responsible president, that I got to try to do something to defuse this division. You know, even if you have to come on on air and have that crazy fucking uh, press secretary start every fucking press conference with a dialogue of hate, start start. You know, she she uh, 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 McKenna, Kylie McKenna. I hate that bitch. I hate that because she starts off every, everything negatively. If you would ever listen to her talk in his press conferences, she just destroys. She says anything she could possibly say bad about uh, the, the Democrats. That already starts off a negative, uh, a negative okay, vibe. Okay, let's, let's let the Sarge answer that. Sarge. I can't answer anything because I, honest to God, I just put the phone down when Henry talks because I can't. Well, you know what? You know what? Maybe because when when people hear things that they don't like, I heard things that you said that I didn't like, but I listened to you. Henry, you don't even agree. I, I, I listened to you. the The president is not doing anything to defuse the division. No, we're not talking about who's right and wrong right now. We're not. We're talking about trying to get uh, unity. Okay. We're talking about trying to get you and stop the division. Let me ask what we're talking about. Trying, you know, we're not talking about your agenda, my agenda, everybody, about making an effort to stop the, uh, you know, um, the division. Okay. Order, order in the platform. Sarge, Sarge, want to say a few words, Sarge? Okay, Henry. Let me ask you a question. Why do each city have a mayor? Why does each state have a governor? That's their job. And that's that's because they're the ones that control the money. They're, they're the ones that get the money from the government, from the federal government, and then they got their crew and said, "Okay, this is what we got. Here's your job. Here's your budget. This is what you do." And then, so then you got a president that says, "Here, this is your budget." I don't want to have nothing to do with, okay. with, with yeah. your decision. Sarge wants to say something. Sarge? She asked the question, and I'm answering it. Offered the governor of Minnesota the National Guard, and he refused it. So who? So let's keep blaming Trump now, because these yeah. people want to refuse help. Yeah. You know, you can't make it. It's like a, a cesspool of bad decisions are made in every state, and okay, that's but why that's the president is saying it's not up. It's not. I'm leaving it up to the over. governor. That's not the job of the president. Do you not? Right. Know? He's not that's why he did what he did. He's leaving all the decisions up to the governors. He's leaving all the decisions, and then if a governor pisses him off, he's gonna shit on them when, when the time is right. Like right now, he's not too happy with Cuomo because Cuomo. Other platform, Sarge. This is how this is how it works. That's why we have a government, right? Exactly. Yeah. The entire government. He can't. He can't do everything. So oh. he has to. He has to. The mm -hmm. If anything, he should get. He should be in unison with all the governors. The division between okay. it starts at the top. The division between the governors okay. is, yeah. is, 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 is fucked up because it's a domino effect of division starting okay. between the president and all the governors. Okay. The uh, governors make their decisions for their state. That's what right, they got right, elected right, to do. Right, right. That's the president right, can go right. in and just start changing. But then, Henry, right, but then you got the red states and you got the democratic states. So the red states. They oh my god! Them, and they open up early. 
the I red state, the red state the governors state. listened to Trump and opened up their states early. And guess what? They all got sick again, and they're all twenty-two states are quarantined again because they took Trump's advice. And and they're still trying to get put kids in school in Florida. Oh, okay, let's order in the okay, platform. Let again. Mary let let the search uh, uh, say a few words. L okay, let's talk about that. Let's talk about DeSantis who refused to listen to Trump telling him to make sure that he closes shit up. But no, he allowed spring break. He allowed people on the beach. Right. He wanted to run things his way. Right. You know what? Trump told the governors to open their states up. They had the choice not to. Right. So and they opened and they, 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 but he was encouraging them to do it. He had every little thing to blame Trump. I mean, at what yeah. point does it, does it turn to the governors? You know, he was, he maybe, just started wearing masks now. Um, um, he just started anything. wearing masks now. He wasn't even wearing masks. His how many cabinet members got, how many, how many cabinet members got sick, uh, Mary? How many cabinet members Again, got sick? You do understand that everybody who comes within the, within the president's uh, circle gets tested, right? Yeah, and they, some of them got sick. They were listening to him. Okay, who did you get sick? So what, are you going to blame them now? Well, well, you know, uh, he wore a fucking mask like everybody else. Yeah, I I hate man. I can't even breathe them. I got I hate you know I, I, I but I have to. But I hate them. You know, I do. Okay, I, you know, well, look, knock on knock on wood. They knock, knock on down wood, right? I'm, 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 you know, and we're all good. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so what? So now, who's well, now? We're gonna. Well, anyway, oh, anyway, oh. I believe Mary. He could do a better job in in in, in, in creating unity amongst amongst his peers, his he governors. Instead of having everybody fighting, that's like, and, oh my God, that's like him going to Chicago and telling people to stop killing each other. Are they going to listen? You know what? If he was to do that, maybe some people problem. will be like, maybe okay. some people will start seeing some humanity in him, saying, "Hey, this guy, he's he's trying to do something. He's trying to. Oh he could God. go on. He could go on TV yeah. tomorrow and say, hey, all this black on black killing, all this one.'" People, please, let's try to live together. Do you, do you think we'll ever hear those words out of his mouth? Instead of, instead, of, instead of talking about, you know, the Democrats. And, you know, all right. All right. All right. Thank you, Mary Gates. Thank you. All right. All right, guys. So, okay. So, this was never the very. I'm going to win that argument. Okay. okay. I, I, even, I, love uh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. This is the okay. very. Okay. This is gonna be. This is the very first episode of uh, of, of from here to November. We're gonna have plenty to talk about because the idea is well, that we do it here. But I'm not posting but, shit. I but, swear to God, I'm not posting. Let's shit talk on anymore about, on my page. Yo, I'm done with that. Another another thing that is going on too. Does everybody realize that President Trump has a warrant in Russia? That he still hasn't handled. Oh no, I know that. Like, well, oh, you know, he, his taxes is is still a big issue in New York. Um, he has a book out from his fucking niece that's saying, you know, I, I would love to read that book, but I don't read books. I'm a, I, I can't stand reading. Okay, but you know, it's you obvious, know how you were talking. Yeah, you, but, you know how the, you were talking about the mask, right? That he's finally wearing a mask. You know, you want to know why he's wearing a mask, right? Probably his pressure. son's. Pressure. No, his son. No, his son's his son's girlfriend tested positive for COVID. I didn't know that. Didn't know yes. that. Didn't know his that. His son's daughter, uh, his son's girlfriend tested positive. So she's around the family. Uh, they all got to go get tested now. Wow. Yeah. You know. All right. All right. All right. So I like what we're doing. I like this because, you know, this but, how many view? how many people are watching this? I don't know. Right now it's like 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 19 and I saw 30. A little while. It doesn't matter how many people view it. I, I, you no, know hey, what? Tyson, remember back in the days when we had 125 people on here? Remember 125? Mm -hmm. And we used to do like three hour shows, right? Two hours. Well, you know why? Because we were all bugging the fuck out. <laughs> yeah. so, this one is a topic that, you know, I mean. Uh, we don't have it around here. The idea is that our freestyle community, our community of uh, Facebook uh, freestyle, it's, you know, we're here and, uh, you know, this platform is, is a wild platform, you know, and we let people just be them. 
and and talk. Yeah, I like that better. Because at the end of the day, it, it, that, that's what it is. You shouldn't be. No one should be getting upset or anything like that. On the contrary, who knows? Maybe Henry says something over here that uh could make people think or or Mary Gates Girl, just it's like. All, it's all just my opinion because I let's don't talk. Fact, people, let's talk. I, I like fact, conversation. Sometimes lately, I've been fact checking stuff. But here's the thing about fact checking: when you you know you gotta fact check the fact checks. You know what I mean? You, there's information. There's all kinds of information on the internet, but who knows if that shit is is, is official? You know, it, it, uh, the credibility of the shit that's on the, that that they got on Facebook. You know, it, it, unless I really believe, unless you was fucking there, is the only way I would believe something really. You know, but just because you you went to a Harvard and got a degree in research and this and that, you decide to become like Candace Owens. I can't, which I can't stand that bitch. I would like five minutes with her, and I'm not really uh, uh, at her level of education, but I, I could just kick it with her some real shit. Uh, these are those are people that have degrees in research, and they're all number gurus. They got database numbers. They have photographic memories where they can fucking m remember every paper that they wrote. People that have photographic memories are very intelligent, and those are the, the people that debate and the debate gurus, and they go out there. And they talk real fast like this, and they don't even let you get a word in because they talk real fast. Those are those people like her that that shoot you down, man, because because you ask a question and they're very good at twisting shit. Yeah. And, and, yeah. and, and so these so and then they got facts memorized from shit the books that that they read and papers that they did, and, and, and they give you numbers. They throw numbers at you like crazy. So uh, and I don't do that. <laughs> you know. I, I, you know, I just read something and I get get my opinion and I give my opinion. Now, if you agree with my opinion or if I agree with your opinion or your opinion, that's cool. If we don't agree, move on. But what happens is people get into start arguing, arguing, arguing instead of debating. You know, they argue, and, and then that creates more division. I just made up a word, argue. <laughs> That's That's cool, right. Right? I like that one. Brand new one, people. Big round of applause here for the for Henry that made up a brand new word. What is it? Instead Argu of debating, argubating. Argubating. I like that one. So <laughs> this one is this I don't one know is where I get this shit from. I don't know. <laughs> you're, 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 All I got you're... is a GED and some college. All right. So <laughs> this is the very first episode of a bunch of episodes coming up next. Because those subjects that people don't want to talk about, we are interested in talking about them. Election 2020. Why? Because somebody's going to do it. And around yeah, here, but, around but here the, ain't nobody want to talk about this one, but we do. We want yeah, to talk but for, about all it. The, for all these Trump supporters, I just want to know, what do y'all think about him having a, a warrant in Russia? Like, I want to hear what y'all got to say about that. That's what yeah. I want to know. Right. Michael, how did you find out about that? Where did you hear that? That came out. I've read that on, fa I've read that on Facebook. Yeah. All right, so we're going to pop oh, there. Can Let's... I talk about something else that I found interesting? Say it, sir. Say it, sir. Say it, sir. Fake news. That's Fake one news. of their favorite defenses. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Fox News been around for 23 years. It's owned by a gentleman named Rupert Murdoch, who's an Australian. Now, Fox News, is to me, is one of the biggest propaganda machines we have because they're always comparing other countries with us, with what we're doing here, and against the Democrats. So they called, the other day they called New York Times fake news, the New York Times, because New York Times, um, po every day they put out a posting on COVID virus numbers. So there's a big conspiracy about the numbers. They're saying that those numbers are fake, yada, 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 fake news, fake news, fake news. So, I'm, so I decided to do some research on both Fox News, and that's how I just find out the information from them. Now, they said New York Times was fake news. New York Times was 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 born in 1851. It's 151 years old. It has 131 Pulitzer Prize trophies. Now, how can you call a company that's been around for that long that has so many trophies fake? Make sense? Would you have, if you was a gambling man and you had those, the, the specs on New York Times versus a 23-year-old company that's, on, that's owned by a foreigner, who would you tend to believe infinite, uh, news is more credible? 
one that's been around for 150 years that has 132 Paul surprises, or one that's only been here for 20 years? Um. <laughs> you you yeah. believe uh, you 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 believe the New York Times, right? Yeah. They, they're more credible. They have 120 Pulitzer Surpri- 130 Pulitzer surprises. They've been around forever. I would believe them more than I would believe this a new. So 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 when they call something fake, when they they're very easy, quick to call a a a, a, a an, an industry a, a media fake when they've been around since the, since for a century. You know, that that was my point. You know, I, I mean, I just use that as an example. They they use that as a great defense. Everything that they don't like is fake. Mm-hmm. I could say, Mike, I could say, Sanson, I bid. It's fucking fake. I, and then I could go and say, oh, I don't like myself. He walks around with a fake beard. You know how many people won't research that and say your fucking beard is fake? <laughs> <laughs> and that shit is dope. I like that shit. Is, that shit is dope. You got that. You got that shit on. Um, I like. Did I still the use the word fleek? You got that shit on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know. But the point I'm trying to make, I can go on Facebook tomorrow and say, "Yo, I met Sasson. He got the fakest fucking beard ever." Trust me. You can see and all these. Oh, Sasson got fake beard. They, you know, they won't. They won't research that, and if they don't believe I, you it, know, I'll fuck give me a second right now because I've been watching Rick uh, Sepulveda's comment, and and he's like borderlining from uh, Ray, Ray contra- Sepulveda. Is that the, is from, is that the musician? From controversial, it's, he's borderlining from controversial to like bullying. It, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, the one and only Sarge. Is he? A, Sarge. Is he? A, is that, is he yeah. I think he's a. I wonder if he's a, a, a musician, a salsa musician. That I know borderline. Sepulveda borderline that from, from, from 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 debating like from debating with uh with uh Mary Gates to bullying, and you know Mary Gates has uh she she well, she, she don't give a fuck. You think she cares? She no, care. Mary Gates will come through. Next time we'll come through again tomorrow or the next day because you know we're gonna talk about this one, people. The, uh, you know this don't one fuck is with my girl. Don't fuck with my girl, Mary Gates. Don't fuck with Sarge. Team side. Bra bra. Bra bra bra. Okay, bra. so this one, yeah, this one is. He has an opinion. Don't say bully. Okay. 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 An opinion. Oh, the, anyways. We're gonna, bully? This, bully? Bully? No, because he says uh, another guy. Bully, 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 bully. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> bully, 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 bully. bully, bully. <laughs> Give me a second. Order in the platform. He Yo, says. Before we go, I got to make sure I send you a friendly Don't say bully. He has an we opinion. I will. Up on Facebook. I got you. Go ahead, Bernardo. I got you. I got you. Go on. Right. Go ahead, Bernardo. Yeah. No, we. This one is a. This is a, a heated one. This, this, this one. That's why we need to come through because I love, I love, I love our, our platform because, you know, we come through. Henry, how many? All of us. We all met each other through the crisis center. Remember? Yeah. Isn't it incredible how it is that it's supposedly, allegedly, in such a horrible place, so much unity has happened in such a horrible place that we all, we all friends with each other now. Yeah, but 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 you know what? Hold on, Bernardo Henry, you ready? You yes, ready? Hold on a second. May accusing uh, uh is saying that that Mary Gates is a racist. Oh. <laughs> it's hey, a listen, listen, listen. Michael Ray, Sasson, Ray, listen. that's your opinion because I know her personally, and she is not. Okay? Oh, oh, Henry, Henry, and, I, and I will say, you know, your opinion because you heard you heard her words, you heard her opinion. Hey, those are her words, and yeah. you got yours, but she is not. I know her personally. Because yeah. if she was, I would not be friends with her. Because no. okay? I despise racists. Yep. Okay? No, I no. have family members that also support Trump. Yeah. I have family members, and I still love them. They're my family members, and they're not fucking racist. So not opinion. all Trump supporters are racist. Of course they not. may have a distorted way of think of support of, of reason why they want to think support him. But they're not racist. And okay. by the way, we know Michael Sasson has nothing to do with that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the disclaimer. Put the disclaimer. Yeah, yeah That's this, a disclaimer. This, this program is the 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 uh, election 2020. The allegedly, allegedly. And, we, and we I'm speaking to help you out because she's a friend and, and she's not here to defend herself. And Bernardo is spitting the words that people are, are typing. So I just have to come out and say that. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Bully, no, no, no. We, bully, 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 bully. I love the platform. Bada, bada boom. 
we're hey, coming through. Oh, shit. There was something. From here to November, maybe we can be people. Maybe we can, we can somehow oh, guide fuck people. Out of here. <laughs> and order in the platform. Oh, order. Let me start order. getting flashbacks, Michael. Order. Order in the platform. Order in the platform. Okay, maybe sorry. if we, maybe is we who is going to help people, guide people towards that moment when they find themselves in that voting booth. Have, that we have to make that serious decision. Who knows? Maybe in a very funny way, in our own way of doing, of talking, maybe we guide them towards clicking on the right candidate for the job. And that's what the uh, ultimate goal is, to find the right candidate for the most important uh, uh, spot, chair, place uh, on earth, the presidency of the United States of America. Maybe we can be of a help in that. Wow, that then Jesus would have to come down to earth, bro. <laughs> Why Jesus? Yo, you know, we Bernard, Bernard, a real quick question: Who was the person that said um, that she might be racist? Rick Sepulveda is the one that is uh, up. Do, uh, do, do me a so yeah, do me a solid favor here over here. Do me a He's solid favor. Put Rick on the phone. No, because people have to go to sleep already, bro. So the idea is let's pause it for a moment. Let's pause it for a moment. And uh, we be back. Maybe we be back. You know, we're going to be back plenty of time with this Hold particular on. Wait topic. A minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Fuck out of here. Yeah. yeah, you know, we Bernardo, all got to. That's I gotta, a close I, excuse. Maybe you, Bernardo got to go take a shit or something. <laughs> no, I'm just I'm hungry. Hungry. You hungry? I got to no, I gotta wake up at six o'clock in the morning. Yeah, there real. you go. That's well. Be well, tell the fucking truth. Talk about people gotta go to sleep. That is the big chance excuse. Twelve nineteen. <laughs> Let's leave it there. Let's pause it. We had a good conversation today. It, you know, this one is very promising, and we're gonna cover this one from here to November. So, hurry up. What you need to do is inform yourself correctly because we're coming through. That way, okay. when you come through, you are well informed, so you don't speak no nonsense around here. No, the only. Nonsense over here is me, and listen, I'm quiet. Listen, we're gonna get the New England I mean, girls on here. I'm super quiet. I'm gonna bring hey. I'm gonna bring the New England girls on here to talk about this too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bring the girls over here, and we we lacking the look. Yo, Michael's a song. Hey, 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 Bernardo. Is hey. that a new Is that a new microphone you got there? Sorry, it's the same one, the same old mi microphone. The, oh, that's uh, okay. Oh, okay. That's okay. It's working good. Yeah, good. The it's CAD. Good. I, got, I got a CAD, the CAD microphone. Right, yeah, I did some research for that for you. Yeah, you got it. That's yeah. a good one. That's a good, good, that's mic. good I, I researched that for you. I remember. Yeah, it's a good mic. It's a good mic. Yeah. All right, guys. So thank you for watching, everyone. And, oh, and hey, uh, hey, 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 how's Rocky Ramos doing? Any update on how he's doing? Rocky? Rocky, he's. It's still the same? Still the same, bro. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh. So we be back. Oh, for sure, we're gonna be back for this one, people, because this yeah, topic right. is hot, and we're gonna not only be back. We're gonna we're gonna rock this one from here until we have a new president. That the new president could be the same one that we have at this particular moment. Yeah. Could be Donald Trump. Maybe he is the right person for the job. Well, so the only, the only way yeah. the only um, way people. So, be, mm -hmm. uh, I, I'm gonna say this. If, um, first of all, you got to be fucking insane to even want to be a president of the United States. So I guess if you, if you, if you, you might as well act insane too. <laughs> you know, I mean, I could run for president. All I got to do is just touch a girl in the private area and oh. be president. Oh, like you said, remember that video? Grab him in the pussy, right? Remember? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck him right in the pussy. Fuck him right in the yeah. pussy. All right, guys. I like this one. I like this one. Have a good night, everyone. And uh, maybe tomorrow we come through again and we keep on talking about right, this one. Bro. Election 2020. Everybody stay Let's... safe. Peace out. Thanks, All right, ladies. Thanks for the call, man. Later. Right. Thanks. Thanks for being here. Bye. Bless. Yeah.